Hey everybody, so it's been a few weeks since I was able to make a new video. I recently had some knee replacement surgery, but I'm feeling a lot better, so I thought I'd come out here and have a little fun with you guys, show you some of the uh, tomato weeds and how they did. Some people would call them volunteers, I like calling them weeds. Uh, it's a lot of fun seeing what you'll wind up with. With uh, no further ado, I'm gonna turn around here and show you guys some of these weeds and, and, <laughs> and how well they're actually doing. All right, so this is the first one here. It's obviously some kind of a cherry tomato. It's doing exceptionally well, but all my tomatoes are doing really well this year. As the aquaponic ones over there. I have no idea what kind of cherry tomato these are. They do turn red. It's starting to be a very productive plant. Again, not sure what kind of tomato it is, but it's doing really well. Look at this, it's climbing up the pea trellis. There's the uh, fall peas in the background there. But the ter cherry tomato here is climbing right up along with them. Pretty remarkable, I think. Absolutely a beautiful plant here. It literally just popped up in this spot, probably from the compost. I, like a lot of you guys, I get these weeds all the time. I'm gonna show you a couple of more, and then one of them that's, <laughs> you'll see it, it's, it's pretty funny where it showed up at. Okay, so now this one here appears to be a different type of tomato. I'm not sure what it is again. It looks like it could be some kind of a slicer. It's a little bit on the bigger side. I did put this one in this pot, but it sprouted up in a, in a random you know, place right back behind me here uh, in one of the other, I think it was in with my eggplants right behind me. So I put it in here about, I don't know, a month and a half, two months ago, and it's doing really well. This is in with my, it's a rose bush that's, that's in here. It's got a lot of tomatoes on it. Still, I, again, I have no idea what kind of tomato it is. Hopefully it's not this uh, yellow tomato that keeps popping up that neither one of my wife and I like. And it uh, looks like that's kind of splitting right here a little bit. I may have to uh, try to try to support that somehow. Otherwise I'm gonna end up losing that branch. That'll be kind of a bad deal. Let me see here, how would I support that? If you guys have any ideas how I could support that, why don't you uh, give me a comment? But yeah, I mean the, the branch itself is doing okay, but it is just barely hanging on. And I'll have to do something here to uh, give that a little bit of support. But anyway, this is another weed, if you will. Look at all these tomatoes on here. This is free food, man. I love it. This is great. Take you to the last one here. And last but not least is this crazy thing. This tomato plant is literally in the yard. It just popped up and I decided, well, let's put a cage around it, see how it goes. And it's got quite a few tomatoes on it. It's not my most productive plant, but it's just a weed in the middle of the yard. So, you know, it's free food as far as I'm concerned. That's, it's looking pretty good. I haven't really watered much of this. I haven't really done any particular care other than I did prune it back a little bit today. It was a lot bushier than this. It was just time to get it pruned back. But look at all these tomatoes. Some kind of a cherry tomato again. Not sure what it is, where it came from, but here it is. Looking pretty healthy. Kind of crazy how that works. All of a sudden, you know, these things will just sort of, sort of just pop up wherever. You know, if you guys have any of these uh, tomato weeds or volunteers and you're having some success, tell me about it. I'd be really interested in what kind of weeds you guys ended up growing. If you get anything out of the video, like, share, and subscribe. Feeling great. Have a great day.